yeah, in, in Europe, yeah, every athlete knows there's some good uh, New Year's Eve race and that's normally completely different towns than you expected. There's uh, small towns, so also in Germany, in the biggest uh, or nicest Silvesterlauf with a lot of um, competitors are in Trier. So that's like the, yeah, it's like the New Year's Eve run like Sao Paulo uh, in Germany. Um, and also what I like is, uh, um, yeah, the long distance, like 8K. And what was special this year that a lot of, yeah, German athletes were on a start line and every athlete has a good, yeah, season this year. So they were cross national champions. They were uh, a lot of participants from the Europeans. Um, so alone the German athletes um, were internationally, um, yeah, like in good contention with, with all the other guys this year. And of course, um, the favorite was the two times winner in a row, Isaac Kimeli from my training group uh, from Belgium. Ich denke, die äh, ist, ist eine sehr gut besetzt, würde ich sagen. Mhm. Da sind schon, wir sind schon ziemlich gemischt. So eine Marathonläufer, aber auch eine Sprinter. Also jeder hat dann natürlich auch einen äh, eine Vorteil und Nachteil. Äh, die Sprinter, äh, für die Sprinter ist ja auch ein bisschen zu äh, lang, 8 Kilometer, mhm. wenn die 1000 Kilometer laufen müssen. Und für uns äh, als Marathonläufer ist ja auch ein bisschen zu kurz. Äh, Ich denke, das wird, das wird sehr spannend und, äh, und es wird schon von, von, von am Anfang an gedruckt und äh, ja, mal schauen. Also es könnte schnell werden bei den Ja, Es sind ja auch noch, glaube ich, Maximilian Torwart genau. am Start, der ist ja fast deutscher Rekord, glaube ich, in der Halle. Also der von nicht unterschätzen, gerade auf 8 Kilometer. Ja. Markus Görge hat gezeigt bei den Crossmeisterschaften, äh, ist kurz vor Schluss mit seinem Seitenstechen, war auch vorne bei, bei mit Samu. Äh, also von daher ist die Konkurrenz enorm groß. Auf jeden Fall. Was macht ihr da? Die Jungs wollen ja heiß. Geht ihr das? Ja, das wäre super. Das ist viel besser. Also das ist auch wunderbar zu spüren, einfach, dass, dass es, man sagt es ja immer den Zehnkämpfern nach. Die haben so eine tolle Atmosphäre. Aber es ist zu spüren, das ist auch einfach äh, auch unter sportlich härtesten Konkurrenten also auch wirklich eine, eine Freundschaft möglich. Und das ist das Schöne, was wir hier jetzt auch erleben. Und Der Trierer Silvesterlauf ist ein bisschen lockerer dann als ähm, Olympische Spiele oder Weltmeisterschaften und ich denke, das wird jeder von euch äh, hier auch äh, genießen können. Und der deutsche Rekord in Anführung, da werden ja nur Bestleistungen geführt, den sollte man an der Stelle noch mal erwähnen. Gelaufen von Romeo Tesfaye im Jahr 2013 in 22 Minuten und 38 Sekunden. Das ist die Marke, die, naja, vielleicht backen zu mal. Ja, hallo, willkommen in Trier. And yesterday we arrived with the car, it was very nice uh, because there was no traffic and today warming up. Um, with with my training partner Isaac, who is also my competitor tomorrow. We did the 12k easy run, and now um, you're here at a press conference, and we saw some of the competitors of the 8k in Trier. So I'm looking forward, yeah, for the yeah for the guys, uh, and uh, yeah, I'm curious uh, what they can do tomorrow, and I hope for a win. Um, the last training was nice. Um, yeah, you can also check the training uh, from Christmas. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward. Now it's time to find a place for this number. Hey, good morning, guys. Um, yeah. Today it looks cloudy, but it's a little bit wet, but not raining. So when you see the course, um, it's it's fine, um, but it will be a little bit slippy, I, I think. Um, but that's okay. Um, yeah, in the morning I drink standard green tea to get a little bit awake 
Um, I don't like coffee for my stomach before the race. Uh, after it's good <laughs> to get it warm again. Um, but uh, yeah, that's that's my favorite drink, the tea. I also have a little bit of sweet uh, ginger tea. Um, it's also very good and just a little glass of, of water to get it fresh. And yeah, like standard uh, honey bread and and uh, jam bread with a little bit of butter. So the race is yeah in some hours and yeah just have a little bit in the stomach, not, not too much, that it's not too heavy, um, and I can perform well. So yeah, that's the story of a normal <laughs> runner. Um, in the morning, it's nothing special in my case, so no uh, porridge or something. Yeah, I'm actually checking the course of Trier. So you see in the night there was a little bit of rain. Uh, here's a good part of the course because there's just a yeah, normal uh, normal street without the small stones. So that's actually the, the fastest part of the course. So I'm looking forward here with all the crowd. So they will do the, the course in, in some hours. So it will be nice. And here you have all, always two attend of these bumps and the small holes. So better stay a little bit on this side or on the other side. Um, yeah, to have a good bounce with the shoe. That's, that's the best thing. So all these shops will be closed when we are starting. That we have more space, of course. And yeah, after this, this long straight from the start, um, this is the second corner. Yeah, this part uh, we're running also uh, eight times, so there are eight laps. It's a little bit, yeah, uphill passage. You see all the small stones. Yeah, you have to attend a bit um, but uh, yeah all the shops right and left um, yeah it will, will be nice here and very tight um, here will be i guess some athletes attacking um, yeah, of course because on the next corner it's the last corner of the of the of, to the finish uh, and yeah here will be the decision i guess on the last lap hopefully <laughs> Only in the last lap. Um, yeah. Really fun. Yeah, here the cobblestones are very slippery at the moment, but there's some hours more that it can try. Again, the finish line is over there, and the start line is over there, and there will be thousand spectators uh, cheering for us, and we will throw some confetti <laughs> to our face. It will be a lot of fun. And yeah. Looking forward with uh, 50 guys on the start. Uh, yeah, will be nice. Yeah, she has been. Okay. Now it's time for the second breakfast. Yeah, today I used the Meta Speed Sky Plus, so the new version. Because, yeah, last time I told you on the track I used the old version because the track gives you already bounce in back. But uh, today on the road and especially on the hard stones, small stones, uh, I like more the new version. Um, yeah, of course it gives me more bounce and I can react better um, to follow the guys and hopefully be in the front at the end of the race. So yeah, this uh, shoe yeah give me very like confidence that i yeah that i can yeah perform well today and now we we warming up with the champion from trier two times winner isaac um, yeah just a 4k we're doing uh, like in four minutes pace to be a little bit uh, faster and yeah and then we are 
prepared good for the race. So With sunny weather, 18 degrees in December, it's amazing. So, yeah. Just uh, keep going now. Okay, let's, let's go. Let's go, Isaac. So bad. So bad. You ready? Yeah. Where are you going? Yeah, we're going this way. Yeah. And then we just move a little bit. Okay. Um, we prepared us the race a little bit, so like 50 mi minutes before the race. Um, I did the 1K in 350. Um, that when I start, that it's not feeling really crazy for the legs. Yeah, of course, uh, the start uh, did a little bit need a little bit longer time because there was a lot of introduction of all the athletes. <laughs> <laughs> so that, that they were on the start line, it was 18 degrees, but we, <laughs> we felt a little bit cold. Um, that, uh, yeah, it was a little bit scary about the preparation that we did a little bit too early. But, uh, yeah, at the end it was, it was fine, like that. Yeah, from the beginning, um, it's like you have just 50 meters and then it's the first corner. So therefore, <laughs> I was very hard attacking from the start. The next meters, there was a lot of uh, change uh, position um, from all uh, contenders. Of course, there were Isaac Kimeli, uh, around <laughs> like seven German athletes. It was <laughs> very funny uh, because uh, in the beginning, I stand, was in the in the front position, but then I hide the, a little bit in the back uh, and was at like the eighth position. And yeah, after four laps, um, yeah, I, I felt that the course is, is very perfect. In the morning it was a little bit slippery, but then it was completely dry and it really can, could attack on all the corners. It was 90 degrees uh, corners and you didn't, yeah, saw the other side because there were all houses. On, yeah, on the on the course. Um, so after four and a half laps, I attacked the second time. It was in the front, and I guess I split the, the group, but I never, yeah, looked back. So I didn't know exactly that. Uh, but uh, yeah, if I saw some uh, pictures and videos uh, after the race, it showed me that the attack was right. Uh, and then uh, also the other Germans like Amanal. Uh, Petros, Nils Vogt, and also Ezekiel, the attacked also. Um, so, but it was was never uh, from from my feeling that I lose contact. It was always smooth uh, from my side, from my body. Um, but in the last lap, uh, Amanal and Isaac kicked very hard on the small, slightly increased passage. 500 meters before the finish line, and there I lose hunting and felt my lactate in my muscles, on, yeah, on my arms and in my legs. So there I had some distance uh, from these both uh, athletes, but um, <coughs> I could uh, pass uh, the third guy in his foot um, in the last 500 meters, and uh, yeah, then it was a long straight again. And yeah, the spectators they're cheering a lot, and yeah, then it was my typical sprint finish, like in Munich, and yeah, 50 meters uh, to go, I, I passed uh, Amanal again, so then I was second and only two two seconds behind Isaac.
25 Jahre hat er gehalten. Das ist Streckenrekord und deutscher Rekord. Yeah, it was really nice. Second place. And my sprint was working. I beat Amanal again in the sprint. For Isaac was a bit too far away because on the small hill, uh, yeah, it was a bit too hard. He had packed, so I'm very lucky with the second place and also did a little bit of pace so that it was happen to break the course record. Um, so it was good that we that we changed every lap. That, that we reached that fantastic time, so I never expected that. You know uh, what I trained the last weeks? Yeah, almost nothing. No shape at all. This is no shape, you saw it now. And both of us, Isaac and me, was under the old course record. So that was really amazing because it was 2.47 pace. Uh, I never expected that on this uh, period of time. And so I'm very lucky also for Isaac because my training colleague. So <coughs> I'm with my second place at this period of time. I, I'm very happy and looking forward for the next steps. Richard und Isaac, ihr kennt euch, gleiche Trainer, ihr verbringt auch so viel Zeit miteinander. Er hat gerade eben sehr gegrinst, das war ein Finish, ihr habt euch äh, ein bisschen belauert. Wie hast du es empfunden heute, wie war es? Ja, ich habe schon am Anfang gleich Gas gegeben, ähm, weil ich wusste, es ist halt sehr eng und ich wollte ein bisschen es nicht so gefährlich machen. Ähm, hat er aber dann erstmal schon gleich gemerkt, dass es ein bisschen zu schnell war, ging gleich in die Beine rein, aber... Ja, wir haben uns gut abgewechselt auf der ja, windigen äh, Geraden hier. Ähm, die Zeit war natürlich sehr schnell, wir haben uns gegenseitig gepusht und ähm, ja, Isaac hat dann zum richtigen Zeitpunkt angezogen, äh, wo ich dann nicht mehr mithalten konnte, weil hinten raus kam ich noch ein bisschen näher. Ähm, das ist ja meine Stärke und dann hat das Publikum ja auch natürlich nochmal getragen. Ähm, und zwar war es was ganz Besonderes heute. Äh, bei dem warmen Wetter konnten wir natürlich deswegen auch so schnelle Zeiten laufen. Das war ein ganz großer Applaus und alles Gute euch, Alza Kimeli, Amara Petras, Richard Ringer. Kommt gut in ein gesundes neues Jahr 2023 und dann sehen wir uns hoffentlich in einem Jahr an dieser Stelle wieder. Dankeschön, thank you very much. Danke.